1940. Worried by reports that advanced Nazi occult research would give the Germans an edge in the war, the British government decided to start its own occult research program. Deep in the Mar Forest of East Africa, hundreds of Kenyans were experimented on and sacrificed in a supernatural arms race with the Third Reich. It worked. They uncovered something. Then people began to disappear. Whole villages vanished overnight. After months of experimentation, the locals rose up and stormed the facility, resulting in a massive explosion. Whatever dark power they had summoned was released. Strange, twisted creatures terrorized the formerly peaceful villagers. The locals responded to this threat by forming a group called the Witchfinders that eventually became a classified arm of government codenamed Ngao. record is Agent Odongo. Um, this was my first assignment and um, predictably it had to be a baptism of fire. Almost literally like you don't understand. I mean I had done my homework when I joined this division but you know there's only so much the internet and newspaper clippings can prepare you for. It was my first day with my new partner. She's a legend in the agency, more successful in the field than any other agent. Well, except her last mission. Apparently she encountered some sort of portal. Most of the details are still classified, but she and her partner got pulled into it. She managed to get out. He wasn't so lucky. No one talks about it, but she seemed different after that. Colder. If I had known how it was going to turn out, let's just say I would have taken a desk job instead. We have a case, newbie. Let's get going. But I just ordered. Where are we going? An anomaly was detected in downtown Nairobi. You cannot be serious. My first assignment and we're going to the most volatile place you in the country. You knew what this job entailed when you signed up, Odo. This is why I told HQ I don't need an assistant. Don't you mean partner? No, assistant. And chauffeur. You're driving. Have you ever wondered why all that weird stuff keeps happening in Nairobi? I mean, honestly, if I lived there, I think I'd just move. Well, Nairobi is at a junction point of two meridian ley lines, which usually causes a fracture in the fabric of space and time. What? Didn't you cover this in the academy? <laughs> Have you seen the size of that handbook? I didn't think anyone actually read through that whole thing. Anyway, the captain specifically wanted me on this one. He'll send us more information on the way. Alex, um, about your previous partner, Moriah. Do you remember anything of what happened when you both got pulled to the other side? I don't want to talk about it. Fair enough. I'm just saying. You know, if you ever need to, you know, share. I'm a good listener. Because I know it must be really hard for you not knowing what actually happened. Just worry about yourself, freshman. You already know that an anomaly was detected in downtown Nairobi. New information obtained is that the energy readings are similar to what Alex dealt with before Agent Moriah's disappearance. 
Now, I don't want to raise any alarms, Alex, considering that you've just recovered from your last encounter with this anomaly. But you're the most qualified agent to deal with this. Watch yourselves out there. Be careful. We'll take care of it, Captain. Good luck, agents. Over and out. It's larger than any I've ever seen. Let's destroy it. A portal this size, who knows what kind of entity can come through it. What the hell? Ebu, we take care of this quick. The gate has already been opened. Soon we will invade your planet. You cannot stop us. Now die. Our guns are not having an effect on it. You think? Maybe if you shoot the power unit, it will close the portal. I'm on it. Oh, the wait! Our shields are going to charge! No! Oh, no! It seems you can never hold on to your partners, Alex. How do you know my name? <laughs> Alex. Don't you remember our previous encounter? When we took Moriah? He's still with us, you know. Don't you want to come and join him? Alex. Is that you? Please help me. Lies! You're lying! If you want to come to us, then we'll take your new partner. It's gonna be happening again. His life is ours. No. I won't let you. <laughs> Foolish girl. I won't let you take him. Try and stop me. What? Possible? That energy harkens me. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go.
Let us go as expected. She is ready.